Hey YouTube, what's up? Well, I've noticed that there are a certain number of people who like to watch the videos that I put up on YouTube of me just playing records. So I thought I'd give you, you know, a little tour, if you will, of the record player itself. And here it is. It's a suitcase record player. It's not, it's not very old at all, actually. It's one of those made-to-look-old ones. Now... Is made by Crosley. There's the model number if you want to buy it. Let that go up for a few seconds. Now, I saw in a comment earlier today somebody was asking where I got this record player. It was this was on one of the record videos. That um, I got this record player in, I, I can't remember which catalog it was, but it was a it was like some electronics catalog. I think it was Sharp, to be honest. Okay. It's, uh, this thing isn't that old. It's from 2002, August 2002. And I've had it since probably 2003. So, it's not that old at all. It has one of these speakers on either side of it. It's a 12 volt input, so if you lose the uh, cord like I I didn't lose the original cord but the original cord just kind of the wire free so now I'm stuck with a Linksys power adapter <laughs> that I kind of that I took off of a router it takes a 12 volt adapter for power My, the original power thing I got with it broke so I'm stuck with a Linksys thing I got with a router. <laughs> now let me show you the actual thing. It opens with these things, these little buckles, which is pretty cool. Gives it the old feel. Open it up. You've got your typical um, table where the, I don't know what it's called, where the record goes. Got volume and you've got tone. Tone just changes treble and bass like on just the regular player, you know. There's, a, there's just a little red light. It's a little insignificant, but whatever. It also comes with uh, this thing, which you take off. If you happen to have a 45 that takes the really big hole, you put it on here. Then you put the 45 on, start it up to go. Put that back. Also here you've got the needle, which is, has this nice little buckle on it. Unhook that. And one thing that makes this record player easy to operate is to start the uh, table spinning. All you do is this: you pick it up and just turn and just move it to the right. And when that clicks, it starts. And if you want to stop the record, or just when it ends, it'll do this when it goes to the left, and that stops the table from moving. It's a nice little record player. It doesn't have the best sound out of these two speakers. It's stereo, by the way. But it does get the job done. In future videos, I'm thinking about get, getting a replacement needle for the, my turntable that hooks up to better speakers. So, you may be seeing videos of other records on that, on the different one in the future. Oh, one thing I forgot to mention. The needle is a diamond tip needle made by Crosley made by the same company that makes the record Crosley the needle's diamond tip so it, I've ha I haven't had to replace the needle in all the time I've had this record player and I've had it for since 2003 that's what um, five six years somewhere around there can't do math right now <laughs> well and that's all and well that's the record player one very um, important thing I forgot to mention about this record player it's got three speeds, 33 and a third, 45, and 78. 78 on a new record player is pretty hard to find. So if you got like 78s lying around in your attic or your basement, then I'd say this is a good record player to play them with if you need one <laughs> for 78s. And that's all. that's all about the record player. Have a good one, everybody. Ciao.